Hello people, welcome back to another episode of This is Super Duper Dumb, Why Does This Exist? Today, we have another challenge on TikTok. Honestly, I don't even know what to say at this point. You know, I covered a ton of other challenges from this app, and I thought I already had covered all of the bad ones, but somehow, some way, I just keep finding more and more of them, and they just keep getting dumber and dumber. Luckily, this challenge that we are looking at today isn't deadly so i mean you know i guess that's a little plus at the least but still this challenge causes permanent damage to your body so i mean that's always fun speaking of fun if you like this video right now you will get a free fortnite burger that's right liking this video will send a notification to my good friend Crisair, and he will sneak into your house and place a fortnite burger right outside of your bedroom door honestly i don't know what you're waiting for like the video and while you're down there might as well subscribe too my goal is to hit 100k by the end of 2021 and you can help me reach that goal by subscribing i'd really appreciate it and uh yeah anyways you guys already know we have covered some insane challenges that we've seen make an appearance on tiktok we had the gorilla glue challenge which wasn't deadly but was just extremely stupid to do people were gorilla gluing their lips and their hair and just it was extremely dumb we had a challenge where people intentionally made themselves pass out from not breathing and we even had a challenge where people intentionally overdosed on medicine those last two challenges i mentioned both resulted in people tragically dying so those were definitely some of the worst i've ever seen but i mean later this week i will be uploading a video talking about an even worse one than those challenges but anyways sorry for getting a little off track there the challenge we are taking a look at today was honestly more of a trend than a challenge on tiktok and honestly i think that a trend would have to be worse than a challenge because trends have you know more people trying it out rather than people having to challenge themselves to try something something for a trend like it's just everybody's doing it but in this trend people basically tried fixing something about themselves that would usually require a professional to do so and they just completely ignored the fact and took the matter into their own hands and just did it themselves this trend was known as the teeth filing trend where basically people take a nail filer and just go and file their teeth down so that they are all in line with each other. I'm clueless as to of what the thought process that goes on with these people before they go and try a challenge like this is. You know, none of them have any clue as to of what they're doing, and they for some reason don't realize that teeth, like, don't grow back whatsoever. So if they mess something up or end up damaging their teeth, they're going to have to get surgery for their teeth or even possibly get their teeth just completely removed but you know it doesn't matter to them the people who try stuff like this don't really ever think for themselves they just treat tiktok like it's a bible and believe every last thing that they see on the app I remember a while back there was like someone on TikTok who was using special editing effects to make it look like he could grow veins like a vampire hey guys so a lot of y'all have questions about my last video and I'm here to clear some of those things up so thanks not retractable. They come out when I want. My eyes, yeah, they do glow. And I could compel you, but I won't. And finally, speed. And that's about it. <laughs> People actually believe that. People actually think that that is real. Like, he had actually convinced people that he was a vampire. Like, people saw this video. What's up, guys? It's Nick. I'm outside, but I got my daylight ring, so don't stress. You guys asked to see my teeth for longer, so here those are. Pretty cool, right? Anyways, you also asked a lot about my strength. Like, how strong am I? What can I lift up? So I got my car right here, and I figured I'd show you guys. So watch this. So yeah, basically, that's it. Let me know if you have any more questions. What? The dude actually just lifted up a whole entire car? Oh my god, not not me actually believing him. Chill out, dude. You, you're gonna make me believe you. Like, why am I believing him? <laughs> oh yes, he is actually a vampire. Vampires exist. This is undeniable proof. You literally can't make this shit up. 
point is, people just buy into whatever they see on TikTok. It's absolutely crazy. I mean, here's a video of someone who tried doing this thing where you file your teeth down before, and just listen to what happened to her. Girl, don't do it. It's not worth it. I'm not gonna do it, girl. I was just thinking about it. I'm not gonna do it. Okay, hear me out. I did that about a year ago. I tried to file my front teeth, like just straighten them out of nail file. But within like a couple of days, I started to get really, really bad, like pains in my front teeth to the point where like I had to take painkillers every two hours because the pain was so bad. So obviously I had to book in an appointment with my dentist and when I got there, she obviously asked me like, what was wrong, what did I do? And obviously like as embarrassing as it was, I just had to tell her what I did. And she literally said to me, you're an absolute idiot. You've obviously filed into your nerve, like you filed too far. I said I was gonna need root canal. So it was two procedures, like I had to go in twice. And like it kills like just the whole procedure, like especially if you're not numbed, which I ended up having to get done. So please just don't file your teeth. Yeah, none of that sounds like fun at all. She filed into her nerves and her teeth. Like teeth are not a thing to be messing with whatsoever. They really can't be fixed, only replaced or repaired. And then also here's what a dentist had to say about this whole trend. Just did a break. Nice. Yes, you did. And here's why. As a dentist, when my patient asks me to do this, the first thing that I think about is why are their teeth uneven in the first place? In this case, it's because the lower teeth are crowded and are unevenly wearing the upper teeth. Okay, you file them and they look pretty good, but you didn't solve the original problem. So what are you going to do in a few years when they're uneven again and now your teeth are shorter? So as we heard, them filing their teeth down like that isn't going to make a permanent difference. The reason that their teeth were out of line was because they were in a bunch of different positions in their mouth. And over time, you know, teeth move around and shift ever so slightly. So in a few years, her teeth will be shorter and once again, not aligned. So she's just going to be looking absolutely goofy because she tried doing this stupid challenge. I will never be able to comprehend the mind of a TikTok user who follows trends and challenges like this. It's just so fucking stupid to me. People need to stop just hopping on trends and challenges like this and do some simple research before doing so. I mean, like all challenges, there's also the clout and fame aspect of this. People also feel encouraged to do this just so they can get a TikTok to go viral. And you know, if being famous for a few days on TikTok is really worth permanent damage to yourself like that, then you seriously need to rethink your decision making process and your standards because that is extremely stupid and pointless. Clout is not worth that much, especially on TikTok. TikTok clout is basically useless. I have like three pages with 100,000 followers on there that I barely even worked for and I make virtually no money off of TikTok. It is not worth anything. Anyways, that's going to be just about where I wrap up this video. If you for some reason still aren't subscribed, honestly, what are you doing? Uh, just subscribe. I'd really appreciate it if you could do that. If you want to see more TikTok challenges that are honestly even worse than this one, click one of these thingies up on the screen and uh, yeah. Bye.